Hey everyone, this is X-Man from DragonDevs.com and today I want to show you uh, Christian Troy's AOKP build for the Eakin T01. Now, just a note, this ROM is compatible with over 30 different all-winner devices. You just have to download the correct compatibility zip for your device and all that information will be provided in the link below. Okay, the first thing I noticed about this ROM is how smooth it runs. It is very nice, very smooth. All the menu transitions are great. It's very fluent. And there are several options within the ROM itself. Got ROM control here. You have different options about the navigation bar and just general user interface. Like for example, allow 180 degree rotation, LCD density, that'll change the size of everything on the screen on the tablet. Custom carrier label, you can change that which is really neat. Got your navigation bar menu uh, where you can change colors of things on the navigation bar. Uh, you can assign buttons um, you can adjust how many buttons, and now, now right here, this is the uh, standard buttons, of course, uh, back, home, and menu. Uh, but you can add buttons and um, assign them tasks, or you can take away buttons if you don't want them. It's very nice. You can adjust the transparency of stuff in your bar. Button glow. Some really neat things. Get your lock screen options here. Wait to lock screen. Volume wake, which is really nice. I like that. You press the volume and uh, the screen will wake up. Volume controls. Power options. Uh, show screenshot, um, show toggle, there are several things here, um, show uh, airplane, if I turn this off then when I go to power down the airplane toggle will not show up on the menu. Several different things, um, you can just customize this this ROM a lot, you can change the clock, um, battery uh, battery icon you can change the color of it and what type uh, if you don't like the little battery symbol you can change it to text you can change the signal um, color performance you know you can set your CPU and it's just a lot of really neat things that you can control on this on this ROM. Now, something I did notice about this ROM is when I was running stock firmware, there were several apps in the market that would not run correctly, um, especially ones that involved the SD card. Um, for some reason or another, um, like for example. I couldn't find a media lock that would work correctly on the stock firmware. Most of the media locks would only recognize media that was on the internal SD card, which that will not work if you have large amounts of media, say movies or such, because the internal SD card is not very big. Um, now since I've installed uh, AOKP, just about every every media lock works. Um, and it's not just media lock, it was several different apps that involved SD card that uh, the apps would not recognize the external SD card for some reason on the stock ROM. And now they will on AOKP. I won't go into any detail of what apps it was, but uh, there were several. Uh, one really neat thing about this ROM, if you're into gaming, um, 
this ROM does control uh, does support uh, PS3 controller and Xbox controller. Uh, one really neat thing about the Eakin T01 is it has an HDMI port on it. Um, it's really it's really neat. You can plug the tablet into the TV, and you can use your PS3 controller or your Xbox controller to control your game, and you can see it on the TV, which is really neat. Uh, this ROM also supports uh, wireless keyboard and mouse. Uh, for example, uh, I hook this to the TV through the HDMI cable. I have a wireless uh, mouse and keyboard set that only takes one uh, USB dongle. Uh, I can put that in there and I can say sit on my bed or on my couch and control the tablet from the mouse and the keyboard and see it on the TV and it's like working on a big computer and surf the internet and I, it's really neat. Video chat does work on this ROM. Um, Skype works. Uh, a lot of my friends and family use Tango which is a lot like Skype. It works also. Uh, the ROM is just, it's capable of a lot of different things that the uh, stock ROM is not. Um, the uh, ROM does support Flash Player. It will run the, the newest Flash very smoothly, by the way. Um, it does support Netflix, which uh, on some of the earlier firmware on this tablet from the factory firmware, um, that was an issue. Netflix would not work. But uh, check us out at dragondevs.com. Um, Christian Troy is the builder of this ROM. And all the information will be contained in the link below. Uh, all the information of how to download and install this ROM is in the thread. And like I said, it's, this ROM is also compatible with 30 different other all winter devices. Uh, you just have to download the compatibility zip for each one. Thank you for watching. Uh, this is X-Man for DragonDevs.com.